please subscribe and you can download this code from description below. Sure, I'd be happy to help you with that. To decompress a .z file in Python, you can use the Zlib module, which provides a convenient interface for working with compressed data using the Zlib library. Here's a step-by-step -step tutorial with a code example. Make sure you have Python installed on your system. You can download the latest version from the official Python website, https colon slash slash www.python.org. In your Python script or Jupyter notebook, start by importing the Zlib module. Assuming you have a file with a .z extension that you want to decompress, use the following code to read the compressed data. Replace path slash to slash your slash compressed underscore file dot z with the actual path to your compressed file. Use the zlib.decompress function to decompress the data. The zlib.decompress function attempts to decompress the data, and if successful, the decompressed data is stored in the decompressed underscore data variable. If an error occurs during decompression, a zlib.error is raised, and the error message is printed. Finally, write the decompressed data to a new file. Replace path slash to slash your slash decompressed underscore file dot text with the desired path and file name for the decompressed data. That's it. You've successfully decompressed a dot z folder using Python. This tutorial provides a simple example, and you can modify the code according to your specific needs. Remember to replace file paths and names with your actual file locations and names. If you encounter any issues, check the file paths, file permissions, and ensure that the file is a valid compressed file. ChatGPT